What's up? It's your boy, DJ365, CD News. Make sure y'all hit that like, hit the subscribe button, and also hit that bell. So let's go ahead and get straight into it. Who we got in the building? You got Miss T in the building. Don't play. What's going on, Miss T? Uh, you know, just wrecking shop and breaking hearts. That's all I'm doing. Okay, okay. And congratulations to your show. <laughs> Thank you. Mm-hmm. What was that like? What was the whole experience like being on a TV show? Well, the experience of being on television is, it, 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 it's, it's like anything else. You got to love what you do in order to enjoy what you're doing. So mm -hmm. I love being in the spotlight. I love having live camera action on me. So, you know, it worked out perfectly. Mm-hmm. Like having a family full of talent, the singing, the dancing, the rapping, holding the camera. Was it like like having a Jackson Five family? <laughs> well, you know, I'm not gonna lie. They call me Miss Jackson, so you know it's just like uh, they call me the No Jackson in Memphis, Tennessee. So hey, that's what I gotta do. And a lot of times when you have talented kids that sing, act, dance, mom, they end up hating the coach. But mm -hmm. at the end of the day, they end up being successful. So, you know, take the good with the bad. You got to pick your poise. I'm okay. picking mine. What was the day that you really had it in your head that, hey, we're going to take this all the way? You know, I, I have to be honest. This was a dream that started when I was a child. So mm. um, that's what makes it so powerful because death and life is in the power of the tongue. What you speak, it shall and, and will manifest. So I spoke it into my existence. I worked hard for it. I prayed for it. I stayed down, ten toes down. And hey, it happened. Are you working on a new TV show or are you still working on a signed TV show? Well, it's hush hush. Can't mm. tell nobody. But you know, they got some things in the making. I've, I've gotten my, I'll say this, I've gotten my calls that up so, uh, wanting to rev it back up and put it back out. Uh, and they want me on two different um, two different shows. They want me on Miss Pete's Music Factory second season as well as they want me on another one, which I cannot disclose what it's about or the name. Okay, okay. Now, what was it like working with all those kids and different personalities all in the room? Well, you know, I'm gonna be honest. I like cases. You know, um, some people will come in, been in gang. Some people come in, you know, uh, just afraid of the state. So, um, when God you a gift and you know I, I consider that a gift to be able to touch lives it was it was my calling you know working with people from all different walks of life and showing them you know that you can do anything you put your mind to you just got a woman like talk about some of the things you've been doing well I just got back from Little Rock Arkansas they um they gave me uh well I was awarded a living legend award. Uh, okay, they said they wanted to give me my flowers while I live. So right. uh, I'm probably a very young legend, but hey, they still say I'm a living legend. So it, it works for me. Um, just got back from um, being on the set of the new Spy Kids coming out with um, one of the lead um, characters. His, he, was, he actually went up against 8,000 kids worldwide, and he actually got selected out of 8,000 kids to be the new Spy Kid. Uh, for the new Spy Kids coming out. So that was exciting. Just got back in from Texas from that. Um, my girl group Karma is now back together and possibly going to work with this really hot hip-hop group out of Memphis, Tennessee called STMG. All right. So y'all be on the so lookout. It'll look like I got a girl and a boy group. Y'all ready for that? <laughs> All right, now. Shout out to STMG, by the way. Um, now we're talking shout about out, Karma. Out. Now Karma, we just had a quick interview with Karma not too long ago, and that was like, you are the musical genius. You know, you're the one that's really like putting it on, <laughs> stepping everything in the studio, making sure everything come out right. Like, is it hard to really come with all the material for the group? It is. Um, but again, anything that you do, feel like you have to do for with a passion and you love what you do, it doesn't seem like work. But if it, you know, so is it hard? Yeah, it's hard just keeping a group of girls together. That's mm. hard within itself, right. let alone letting it be part of your family. So then you got to, you know, a lot of people don't understand the difference between being a manager and being a coach. Uh, a lot of people want you to, um, they, they, they think they can do what I do and they think that it's easy and they think, oh, you know, I'm going to just take my daughter out the group and we're going to be successful. But 
can't stand that pressure if it's too hot get out the kitchen you already know you heard it from miss t let them know where they can find you at on social media you can find me on instagram at i am and i did say i am dot t-e-m-m-o-r-a i am some more you can find me on upline at i am i am dot t-e-m-m-o-r-a you can find me on youtube at i am i am dot t-e-m-m-o-r-a I am the real some more. So you can find it. I am all social media platforms, all um, platforms out there. If you're trying to find me, I always put I am dot tomorrow because that's all it is tomorrow. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for having me. All right. This your boy, DJ365, CDE News. And I just had a hot exclusive interview with Miss T. Make sure y'all hit the like, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you at the bell. All right. Gang. What's up? It's your boy, DJ365. If you are an artist looking to be seen and heard, hit up CDE News. We also shoot music videos, do interviews, shout outs, and other services. So if you're looking to be promoted, need an interview, or want to be a guest on the show, hit us up on CDE News.